too creepy because I'm talking to my dashboard and I don't know, there's something bright about the colors and the sunshine today, which is so nice to, to feel because a week ago, the same place seemed very gray and very brown. And it's amazing how much taking a break and going to London and uh, just getting away from it all for a second and then coming back can make everything just look, it's like washing. I feel like I put the world in the washing machine with some color fast tide. And uh, I took it out of the dryer and the whole world is warm and fluffy and colorful and bright. And that's just something. That That's really something to, to remember for, for myself, to remember that when everything looks all gray, Sometimes you just gotta throw the world in the washing machine. You know, that's it. You gotta take a vacation, you gotta take a break. Whatever that means, spin it around, put some soap on it. But today's a great day. A lot of work to do still. We have a, a new rap battle suggestion that we just came up with two days ago. Uh, just chose. So, that we're gonna film it on Thursday. So that's a little fast for a turnaround, but that's, a, that's exciting, it's fun. And it's gonna be me and Zach, so it's it you know it's very it's familiar, a little me and Zach rematch, which I don't know if me and Zach have gone head to head since it's been a long time since we went like literally head to head, just the two of us. So that that should be cool. Uh, what else is happening? I have a lot of cool stuff from London to talk about, because the reason we were there was that show, The Crown, and man, it's good, it's really good, and they showed us like a lot of behind the scenes stuff. I got to see, you know, how a major production that, that centers around history gets made. And I got to meet the costume designer and, and in the props room, there was this timeline of typewriter technology, like 1960s typewriters versus 1961 typewriters to make sure that the set was accurate. That's, I love that stuff. That's some pretty dorky typewriter history. And I mean, you can't beat it. I love that level of detail and that level of passion. Um, but check out The Crown. It's on Netflix, and it's incredible. We got to see the, the, the first two episodes. I think the whole, the whole season's out now, because that's how Netflix works. And I asked them, I was like, why do you do that? Why does Netflix release everything instead of like trickling it week by week? And what they told me was very powerful. They said that they want to put as much power and control in the hands of the customer as possible. So they can watch it whenever they want. I thought that was pretty cool. So maybe we'll release like four rap battles on the same day. Probably not though, because that, that day would be December 20th. Uh, which is, their, speaking of rap battle releases, we are not putting up one tomorrow because we want to let the world just deal with the event that shall not be named that rhymes with erection and selection and C-section, but that's all I'm gonna say. Uh, so we wanted to let that pass and just be over with. So the following Monday after November 8th, we'll be putting up, and then subsequently, I think every week after that, I think. It's too, it's too beautiful of a day for me to get too worried about it, to be honest. We're gonna make the best work we can and put it up as soon as we can, and in the meantime, I don't think that you watching this is that concerned about it. And I appreciate that about you. Um, just like I appreciate the heck out of those trees behind me. Man, you can't ask. This is like... A f anyway, good to see you. Let me take off my glasses for a second. Where's the lens? There it is. That's why people... It's easy to wear glasses when you're making a video because you can look at what you're doing instead of saying focused on the lens and not get caught. But if you take off your glasses and you're not looking right at the lens, if you're like over here, doesn't it look a little weird? That's a pro tip for making videos. Don't look at the viewfinder, look at the lens. Ignore the viewfinder. If you can turn it off, that's even better. Cause then I'm talking to you, not looking at myself. Those eyes, it's a powerful thing. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I've left the dogs at home for two and a half hours. So there will be poop. That's part of it. Cuddle monsters make poop. That's just part of life. Anyway.
Uh, hope this finds you very well. I was cruising around. I was thinking about all of you out there and uh, how much I appreciated it last week. And I feel a lot better. And thanks. Okay. Bye. Don't be too loud. Come on, Harry Connick Jr. Man, my arms really are hairy, aren't they? Eh. You gotta accept what you are. Wanna come along? Okay, come on.